Hi friends, now we are going to talk about how we can generate statements for customer balance, vendor balance, GL accounts. Okay, this is very interesting, very important. Okay, and this is of the format that you want. Okay, uh, standard format. So here, if you go the transaction code, I'll mention it. It's a big one, you know, the S underscore once. Okay, so what I'll do, I'll mention it in the YouTube uh, description. Okay, <clears throat> here I will just do for suppose, uh, I will do material lines. It's up to you. I will do for vendor vendor line items. Okay, standard documents. And here I will just select suppose the company code. I put the company code this, and I'll just execute. Uh, we'll see now what are the different line items are there. If if there is any one. Okay, so it's executing, and uh, and this you can directly send it to the vendor. A customer whatever you want you know because sometimes you want to send especially um, they want statements that how much is due because sometimes they might want to reconcile it it's uh, it's something uh, different vendors have different requirements okay so here you can see all these statements if it if it really matters to them okay and here you can just go here and you can print it okay mm -hmm. can you save it uh you can save it to your local file always okay spreadsheet so th it's there so you it doesn't have the, the since this is a statement it will look like this okay uh but uh otherwise and again this statement will be based on you know vendor number you are not going to send a statement for another person's to their inbox the same thing you can do for customers so if let me do for this one so if i did the uh, um, run the program for vendor this and where is the vendor number for the line item vendor account okay and I run this I execute all it will run faster now you know the so it's running and it will give me all the information related with that vendor and then you can you know print it um, you can download it uh, so these are the normal things that you have to do so here you can see all related with this vendor oh, we have a lot of friend but since we are entering these gl accounts and all those things that's why it took so much time now same thing you can do for customers also okay just select this and just uh probably if i did the gl line out because they don't care about gl lines probably they want material lines and i'll execute okay uh, so then the list would be much smaller and again you can select parked noted items recording and all those things you can put further filter here master record this is very useful okay just to let you know everyone should be using it uh, so so now it's showing you can see the balance and all those things this is pretty useful okay so that's it stay tuned to my sap channel and happy sap learning and have a great day